getting laid with Netflix and chill is an art. The perfect flick to turn into a fling isn't an Academy Award winner, nor is it a plot heavy genre film that requires your undivided attention. If you're inviting a girl over to enjoy a film, it cannot be one of your favorites. Instead, think of picking a movie the way you would pick a soundtrack and select something that sets the mood so it's not ruined by small talk, laughter, or ideally smooching. The type of film that flattens out right in the middle of the second act and into the third act. And needfully so, because by that time you should be deep into other things. See what I did there? One might immediately think that films like Boogie Nights or Blue is the Warmest Color because, well, sex, sex, and more sex. But those films probably will end up having the opposite effect. The girl gets tied up in the story instead of with your t-shirt, consumed by the story and not with your hands. While horror films are good, causing most girls to cuddle up underneath you, stay away from heady-handed metaphors. It Follows or Raw, both really good films will turn her off before she even gets turned on. So here are my top 10 list of movies to flicks chill with. Magic Mike, I know, I know, but let me explain. When you are Netflix and chilling, your job is to accommodate. Unless she is a type of woman who likes action, adventure, and fantasy, Magic Mike is one of the best films to get and keep her in the mood. The whole thing is based on female pleasure. Tons of hot, emotionally available guys travel around with the sole purpose of making women feel sexy, cared for, and catered to. And if it doesn't sound like the perfect flicks chill material, then you don't know women. <laughs> Sleeping with other people. This is your standard rom-com. The leads are screwed six ways from Sunday and it's really sexy. The leads are monogamously challenged people who meet at a sex addict anonymous meeting years after giving their virginity to one another. All the rom-com stuff happens, but the sleeping with other people definitely has an edge. There's an undercurrent of sex appeal that any man can use to his advantage. When mixing charm, confidence, and chemistry, you can up the carnal factor at every turn. While the screen fills with sensual depictions of female pleasure, like during a biologically specific masturbation tutorial. See, told you, someone great. A young woman who's just been dumped by her boyfriend of seven years heads out for a final hurrah with her girls before leaving town. The chemistry on screen leads to some quite sexy moments. There's lots of raunchy comedy to go around on this one, which should also keep any guy happy. So it's just a good fix chill option. Just don't focus on the breakup stuff. Beauty and the Beast live action. I know there's no sex in this, but the romance factor is pretty high. Being a part of the acting in the theater world, I know so many women who are turned up to level 5,000 by this story. This is about knowing what the woman you are chilling with is into. Some women are turned on by rom-coms and some women are turned on by the idea of some big hulking monster giving her the business because at the end of the day, we know that's what happens. Disobedience. The story of a woman who returns home for her father's funeral to her highly orthodox Jewish community, who runs into an old friend who turns into a lover. Their hookups are filled with supercharged sexiness. Rachel Weisz, Rachel McAdams, in my opinion, two of the most attractive women in film right now. They are brilliant actresses and so they pull off these roles convincingly. If you feel the same way I do about these two women, then you'll be excited to watch them make out on camera. <laughs> But women will also love this because they really like these two actresses. And the film shouldn't even get to the halfway point without getting supercharged sexually in the bedroom. Mr. and Mrs. Smith, a movie about a married assassins on assignment to kill one another, is absolutely filled with excitement and sexiness because I mean Angelina Jolie being sexy at everything she does, right? And although it's like 14 years old, it's still a go-to for girls who love action who also love the idea of romance and maybe even some rough aggressive sex. Chloe, when a woman suspects her husband of cheating on her, she hires a call girl to seduce him. As a result, things turn out for the worst, but it turns into this really sexy love triangle with all these sexy erotic thriller vibes. Nymphomaniac 1 and 2, yep, two movies called Nymphomaniac about a self-proclaimed nymphomaniac who's retelling her life of sexual exploits vividly, mind you, to a stranger who finds her beaten up in an alley. Not only is this a damn good cinema, it is one of the sexiest offerings that you'll be able to prevent to anyone to keep them in the mood. From dusk till dawn. The snake dance alone delivered by an Selma Hayek is enough to sell this film sex appeal. Use this film for the girl who loves horror, loves action, and is excited about half-naked women. Fifty Shades of Grey. Yes, you knew it was coming. 
One of the biggest box office smashes in the last 10 years is all about S&M. A young girl connected in some sort of romantic exploration who is opening herself up to a billionaire and the truth of the matter is it really is all about sex. It's all about aggressive sex and domination. Who's the dominant? Who's the submissive? And perhaps that can play itself into your bedroom. So there you have it. My top 10 films that in my opinion are some of the sexiest offerings available online and can be viewed on almost any platform. Remember, when it comes to flicks chilling, comes to friends with benefits, you have to choose a film that is right for her. This isn't about movies that you like. This is about things that she's going to enjoy that are gonna get her excited. And who knows, you might even decide that you like this film after you watch it. What are some of your Netflix and chill movies? Let us know in the comments down below. In the meantime, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Kick the little bell over there. Or is it over there? I don't know, it's over somewhere. On the side, get updates on every uploaded video. If you miss them uh, from other sessions, don't forget to click here and here, whatever. We'll figure it out. Point is, stay tuned, we've got more coming for you. <laughs>